There's some busted up looking rebel comps. And what's that rumble doing in there and shit? There's no gangplank. You know, well, I had rumble when I didn't have a gangplank. Of, like, I have to keep running him now. Uh -huh, uh -huh. All right. Uh, you just give up. I'll, I'll teach you either how to either play blasters, brawlers, or, or rebels the way I'd. But I'm all, I, pretty much every build is just about getting like the legendaries the best way you can. Okay. And then not getting shit on mid game. Boost Lucas audio? Okay. Uh, I think I'm fucking up positioning, because I feel like my team is strong, and then my team doesn't win. This sounds like you're talking about solo queue, look. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> no, my, like, the team I build is strong, but they don't win the fight, so I must be fucking up something. Yo, what item should I be slamming early, by the way? Depends on your build. Okay. Is that better? But like early game, when my build isn't solid, if then is there no item I should be like slamming? Is like isn't like GA worth like slamming down if I have armor and BF? Uh, you can, but like, it just depends. I mean, if you're, I don't like slamming. Let's say you have Lucian and you have like red buff and and giant slayer. That's free yeah. level eight, right? Yeah. And like you could, so you're giving up your BF to do that. But you can be blast, or then you're I guess fourth blasters. Uh, well, no, I mean, I just, I don't know. I, like, I, I usually start now uh, Glove. Glove? Yeah. Why Glove? Because I can just slam it and it builds into every build. Or you can get Tier. Or if you want to play Rebels, I'll, I'll show you how to play. I say get the Malphite or the Tier. Malphite? Okay. Yeah, Got I, him. I like that because uh, you can, basically, like, you you can Thief Glove uh, Yasuo, and with just Thief Glove, he acts as an anti-carry. Like, he'll fuck up their Jinx or their MF or some shit. And, like, that can, like, win you the game single-handedly, you know? Okay, but I'm ending, then I'm going to sell the Malphite for sure, no? Because I want the Glove off him? Yep. Wait, what time do you wake up, Loco? Me? Uh, you see, somewhere between 9 and 10. Today was a little late, because I stayed up playing TFT yesterday. Damn, past your bedtime, I'm telling you woke up at like fucking 1 a.m. Fuck you. <clears throat> oh, did you watch Becca smurfing with fucking 11k viewers? Yeah, she's front page. And then she quit her 24 hour stream. <laughs> Wait, that's an early days. Is there a sane and lo local love story? Oh, yeah. Who... Yeah. I mean, you can play uh, Vanguard Blasters from here, too. You just pick okay. up like the, the cybernetic people. Or... I don't know, always just sell them off. I just fight them off. Them. So pick up the pair for sure, right? Yeah, and the poppy. And the poppy. Yeah, because like right now you can either you can there's like a real, if you find graves then you can just use yeah. that as your opener. Ask my what? You can just use that as your opener and sell it later. Okay. I think vanguards are, are worse than brawlers. Oh, every time late game, even if you three star units, it's like usually worse. Just because you don't have CC. Even Jace and who is it? Um. With the other guy, Wukong really good. Oh, Wukong is dog shit. That unit is so bad. Wow. I guessing I get the pair, right? Yeah, you can. Or the trips. And you can sell, sell Zoe and the Poppy. Oh. I'll, I'll sell it later. In no, case. No. What is it? Well, you want the Ziggs too. Okay. You know what? You'll, you'll, you'll never use Zoe. Like, I don't even look at Sorks' units. Like. Okay, so then I sell Malphite too, no? For the Ziggs? Yeah, you can sell it. Like, Sorks, Sorks may as well not even exist. <laughs> they're, they're that bad. There's literally only two playable builds in the game right now. If you're Blasters to... and Rebels? Yeah, Blasters and Rebels, if you're trying to win. Okay. Wow, look at all these Sork yeah, units. Sell that shit. Get that away from you. <laughs> even if I get an RE2, it's bad. Hell I make no. an RE2 next I would next never round. make that RE2. Okay. Oh, nice. You got the... You can get the Graves. Do I... Damn, okay. he's got the Ziggs too. Should I play to win and level, or get the ten gold? I mean, I'd just, I'd probably level here. Okay. And then you can buy the Malphite and the Ziggs. Ziggs. Yeah. Yes. And you, you level because only. If should, it, I, should I item anyone? No, Quick club on. Yeah, you can do that. That's fine. The only reason you level here is not be to win streak because I look at this board, I don't think it win like win streak. It's to. Mm -hmm. It's to get pirate gold. Because pirates have to kill units to get the gold. Okay.
Nice. We got the gold. And we're winning. Wow, look at it. Two gold from that play. Wow, we're rich. Real five head. Okay, go back home. Oh. No. Um, I mean, you can just play blasters from here if you want. You have Lucian. It's just your items suck, but that's fine. You can just, uh... I mean, you could play Vanguards of Blasters. You, you want to hit Tangled here no matter what, so you should just decide. Like, what, what do you want to play? Uh, teach me how to do Rebel properly. Okay, well, you can just... If that's the case, you just sell that and... Okay. You can sell and then it. I get Rumble, right? For Rebels? No. No? I'll never use Rumble. What?! Rumble. I thought Rumble's a really good transition piece. No, that unit sucks. Just really? Three gold base of gold. You should have sell to get three. Sell your uh, your drive and your TF at the least. Yeah, I'll sell D three. I might not need to sell all of them because I have the pirates. Like the whole point is to be as strong as possible without buying like shit like uh, three cost units and stuff. Like you want to, you like want to be strong with like a cheap board. You get the Yasuo, yeah. Uh, and then, I mean, you can just get rid of the pirates now if you want. You can sell all all the pirates all three and, and then put, yeah, yeah, put the rebels in. Sell these three. Yeah, put these three yeah. in. Yeah, you can just do that right now. And move them back a little bit, like one square. Okay. Or more than that, actually, because you want Kazakhs to isolate targets. There's a lead call. Uh, is there a way to move this? I don't know how to move that. Aha. <clears throat> uh -huh. That's a positioning tip. Well, just in general, like, it's, even when you get ASOL and stuff, you want, you want time for your ASOL to ramp up. Oh, no. That's no, fine. my streak. I've watched a YouTube video from some old bald dude that said you should lose streak or win streak all the way. Yeah, we have 20, so that's fine. Once okay. you hit 20, it's like easy to get up. up from tier, there. right? Tier for soul, the most important? Yeah, tier or glove is the best. Okay. Or, or rod. The most important ace. You want Sarah's Morello and Asol. You can get yeah. that. If you can't, then but, just get the Thief Glove and get Thief Glove Yasuo. Uh, what, did, if, um, what if it. If rod is most important, then no, 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 get the Thief rod? Glove. Go, go, go. Get Thief? Yeah. Okay. I'll get Ari. She's the prettiest. Because. It's always fine to have like more thief gloves. Like, you can have like as many thief gloves as you want in a build. Like it's never gonna be a bad thing. You can like thief glove Asol or I mean not Asol, but like GP. Or, I might uh, be making a choice between getting the thief glove or not finishing Morello by. Yeah, but it, it honestly doesn't matter. Okay. Thief glove OP son. You can sell the two on the bench, and then should I level? No, just sell those. Okay. And then thief glove Kazix. And the Negatron. Too. Oh yeah, I can't put Negatron on him if I'm thief gloving. Like playing for perfect items is one thing, but mm -hmm. it's more important to like be strong. Okay. You know what I mean? Or be as strong as soon as you can while being as efficient as possible. But isn't the isn't five cost units the strongest right now? So I yeah. want to like just kind of econ to eight and have good items for yeah, so level just, eight. But thief club is good on those. Like thief club GP is not bad. Thief Club MF's not bad. Okay. Like, Thief Club's always going to be efficient late game. <clears throat> Just sell the Liana. You're probably going to lose streak now for a while. Okay. <clears throat> the old man in the video said I should lose streak until 3 2. Well, there's there's stuff that can happen, man. Oh, I wish. I hope I. I wish I win this. I want to win uh, this. Yeah, eh, yeah, that's fine. You can stay four. Okay, so here's like a dilemma I run into a lot of times. I feel like I can beat this guy, and yeah. that's bad. It doesn't matter. No. You know, your streak doesn't matter. Once you, the, the main thing streaking is for is breaking out of like twenty or thirty gold. Because like, if you don't start, you start with a lot of gold, right? Mm -hmm. So you have you can play however you want to play. <clears throat> but if you start with like no gold, then it's yeah. like you have to get a streak, or else you're just gonna be poor as shit. Okay. So. It is okay for me to win here, 
Like, yeah, it doesn't matter. Okay. Because you'll get one gold for winning anyways if you do get it. Mm. So it's more important to just be around that 30 gold to be able to like roll units later? Uh, you should buy the Shen. Buy the Shen. Just think about how like, or in the Zaya. Just think about how like compound interest works, you know? Yeah. You can get the Blitz. You need a, um, you just need to put an extra unit in. Probably Blitz. You know how to position with Blitz? On this? Not, no. Where do I put him? Just, just put Shen in instead then. Well, it, teach me. Teach me. This is coaching. It teach should me. be one over to the right. And then you stack all your guys to the right of him. Like here? Yeah. But the only problem here is your Kazakhs might Vapega and kill himself, but you should be fine. Because, <clears throat> like, Blitz will always hook the furthest target. Yep. Ooh, that's a Morello piece. Yeah, you can just put that on Ziggs. Wait, do I sell him later? Yep, always. Ziggs is just your item holder for Aesol. Then how do I get Demolitionist? You know, what is, Demolitionist is useless. Just get off his fat later if you want it. What? This it, stun, <coughs> AoE stun every fucker for 1.5 seconds is useless? He doesn't AoE. But what if it the GP will AoE everyone? If you get GP ulti, you get one shot anyways. Okay. Position your guys for the Zeeks. Position? And, oh, okay. Yeah. For the Zeeks. Yep. But you should still be clumped for Rebel. Like, Clump them in a way that's efficient. Yeah, like that. And Blitz here, fine. Yep. But your Ziggs might get hooked from that position. Blitz should actually be to the right of Kha'Zix. Blitz should be the right of Kha'Zix, okay. Yeah, you always need, because uh, Infiltrators can't be hooked. All right, what do you, what do you usually try to do here, Loco? Because this is what probably- What I do weird. here? Yeah. Um. I'm at 50 gold, so I chill. I probably level on three and three, thir three slash two to get level six. If it's not too expensive, should should be fine. You can sell Jarvan, but I don't know why you're holding him. Holding holding useless is actually worthless unless it's like a four or five cost. By the way, like if you look yeah. at the probability, it's like so low. Yeah, you just get that mastery even, and just level. You just throw him on the board. You can play blade master now, Shan. So if I'm playing Blade Master, this guy goes bye bye. Yeah, that's fine. You can take Malphite out and put Blitz in. That's like actually sell Kazix and put Blitz in. Sell, sell him. Yep. And then put the Thief Glove on Yasuo. This way you have a chance of uh. Actually Blitz here is fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, this way you actually have a hit chance of hitting Econ if you do win around. Okay. Because Kazix is worthless at this point. There's too many <coughs> units, so you can't isolate anybody. Like after Krugs, he's you always should almost always sell him off unless you're playing infiltrators. Okay, get him, Zix. Oh, oh my God, his ult missed. I want a refund. Oh no, it's fine. Oh, oh the Zix pop off. I buy the Shen. Yeah. I usually don't. I, I like running Kale over uh, Shen. I think Kale's like uh, just, busted. I mean, just Kale yeah. enough is scary. Yeah, it's it's a really good combo. I think it's a good DE. You can just go fast seven off this. You don't need to roll or anything. Okay. Fast seven means I'm be tanking HP though, right? Yeah, but you'll be seven. You'll be seven like right around wolves, and then you can roll to get six rebels online. Like just find the jinx, and then the mm -hmm. sona, and then you just go eight after that. Okay, so your build is way more econ focused. Yeah, because the only units that matter are the legendaries. Like literally nothing else matters. Guard, blaster, blaster, blaster. Cybernetics. That guy's like kind of rebel. So I'm going to be competing with Jinx. There are three Blaster players and one other rebel player. <coughs> yeah, but it doesn't matter. It's whoever Econ's better wins. Okay. Unless you get like really unlucky. Soju's in your lobby though, and he only plays rebels. And he, he actually knows how to Econ. Who is in my lobby? Soju, the rank one guy. Who is he? C9KA3S. Oh, I'm playing with rank one player and beating him. You know his smurf, bro. He econ in. All right, should I get the spat? Uh, you can, but. But that yeah, gives I think Morello is pretty good. Morello or tier? Oh, I guess yeah, tier get... then. No, never take one gold ever. You can either get a spat or a glove. I think four gold spat's good. 
Okay. What's the demo piece for Spat again? It's Rod, but I wouldn't worry about that. You can okay. get um, Fawn on later carousels. And Fawn is the best item in the game by far, so. Okay. Like, a lot of people tunnel on getting synergies in early, but it, it, really, it really doesn't matter. Because, like, you're not even going to be using that until you find GP anyways. Like, using it efficiently. And you still need to get Morello, too. Okay. <clears throat> oh, my rumble. Yeah, but how you put him in? You can put just... him in? No, oh. I said, yeah, just sell that level. Level up. All the way? How much does it cost? 30, uh, 20, 12, 12 more. Five, yeah, level. 40 gold. Each okay. level. And then you can just put another E in. I want to sell Shen and put in Rumble. Is that true? Don't do that. Okay. Just put in, put in E. And you can position a little bit better now. Like, um, move your guys up. You don't, you don't have to do this round, but like... You move them move, up one more. Move the whole formation up one square. Okay. And just put Ziggs in the middle. Okay. Well, it feels so awkward, because I normally don't play like this, where my... Like, on six, I'll roll to make sure my guys are, like, competitive. I mean, you're fourth place. You're level uh, seven. What? <laughs> having, okay. having levels and synergies can be just as strong as having a two two star unit. That's like a whole nother unit. It's a whole nother unit on the board. <laughs> or like a whole nother synergy, you know? Yes, Sensei Saint. Okay, move your formation up. And you can just have Blitz on the back left. And Zig should always be in the middle. He's the strongest character until you get a uh... put the Shen on the top. You want uh Sh Yasuo and Shen or Malphite and Malphite and Yasuo is on the front. Because you want Yasuo to go off immediately. So I want him front? Top left, and then Malphite top right. Shen yep. here? Shen to the right, and then Blitz on the bottom left. Here? Or here? Where one of these is. And then Yi on the left. Okay. Oh, like, he should be... It, it's, it's fine. It no, matter. no, give me the ideal. Give me the most ideal. So, like, whoever's in that bottom left where that mm -hmm. Yi is will always get hooked, yeah. right? So here, Blitz uh -huh. gets hooked. So you can just have, like, a tighter bot. I mean, it doesn't really matter, but it's like, you can have better focus if you do it the other way, you know? Okay. Wow, Loka, you're winning. I know. I'm beating the rank one guy. <laughs> rank one is shit. Why are you so good? Upgrade uh, Shen. You can buy Shen. Yeah, you can buy him. Okay. So how many? Wait. You have two. So right now you have mm -hmm. pairs, but yeah. you can go eight really easy, I think. Okay. I would just like slam eight this game and then roll down in like two turns. Okay. And the only reason you're doing that is because of that gold start. So usually, if I had like the Dayaso and the Yi pair, I'd probably roll to hit those or to hit the Jinx. But it's like you're healthy enough to where you can take like three three heavy losses, right? So just like kind of plan the game out like that. It's like how many heavy losses gonna have to like be in the middle of the pack? And middle of the pack's like 50 health right now. What should I do if I'm bottom? Uh, then you probably have to roll for the pairs. All right, these items are kind of troll, but. Oh, you got Yi anyways. Um, you can make Blade Master on somebody also. You can put Rumble in now if you want, and just start pushing levels. I think uh, the bet. Damn, these items are weird. You can make somebody a Blade Master, but I don't think you should do that yet. Okay. Do I just level? Yeah. Or just start pushing gold. levels. Okay. You can give like BT to Yi, I guess. I don't see what else you could do. I would give it to Jinx now. No, Jinx is worthless. You should have literally never put items on her. Just put the BT on the E. Can, okay, question. So there's a, I can get an item here. I can get an item here. Do, wouldn't I want GA for, um, whatchamacallit? Wouldn't I want GA for Gangplank? And yeah, isn't it a... I just like start putting random items on him later. I mean, you can put GA, but it's like, think about how many extra, What like, what are you going to get on this next carousel? Armor, maybe, HP, maybe. Oh, wait, I don't have... HP. Like oh, you, I can't get but think about level. it. You're trying to itemize for two carries at the same time right now, right? Like, mm -hmm. are you realistically going to get enough items for your ASL and your GP at this point? Probably not. Yeah, so, so you buy that Malphite. And you don't have to buy the Blitz. Uh, so, like, you should just itemize to make some of your other people strong. So you can give the BT to the E. Yep. Attack speed too? Mm hmm. It's, yeah, you can put that. You can put it on. It's fine. You can... <laughs> And that you would can... be giant slayer. Just yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. You can dragon claw him too if you want. Okay. 
Or you can Wait. also make Celestial with that later. I think wait on the cloaks. Wait on the cloaks. Okay. I thought cloaks would go into Dragon Claw um for Thol, no? Oh, you should uh level up next turn by the way in all in. Okay. Uh you can drag I don't I'm starting building Aesol more of a DPS scary. Like uh Morello Seraphs and then like whatever. Like a like a demo spat or some shit like that. Okay. If Morello's better on Thol or GP. If GP ults and you're hit by it, you should be dead. Okay. That's why demo sucks. Okay, so start leveling. This is like high APM turn. So you want to so be level pick... all the way here. Yeah, level. And you want to find your six rebels. There's some FGP. Wow, what the? Okay, put him in. Oh, he's only real persona. Real persona. Real persona or Jinx. You should get the Kales too, by the way. I forgot to mention that. Okay. Okay, stop rolling, stop rolling. Oh, there's Jinx, okay. Put all those six rebels in. And... You go with, like, here, right? Yeah, per place, yep. And, and then sell the you... trash? Yeah, sell the Shen, the Blitz. And the Rumble. And you can actually just go to 9 off this, I think. You can put Dragon Claw on Aesol if you want. I don't okay. think it's that bad. Let's go with Dragon Claw on a Dragon. I'm sure it gives extra MR. Yeah. Is he, is, is he a dragon? I thought he was like a world maker. He's a dragon. Okay, so once you find Sona, you sell Ziggs and then uh, you can transfer uh, Morel over. And you're one Fawn here over anything. Fawn still takes priority. Okay. AP for you can do. You can actually do... I'm down with the, the, the stunlock uh, Aesol here. You can get the Rod to do the... To do the... I would Morello want that or... over Morello. I think Morello is like pretty big, but you could do yeah. something. I think just no matter what, get the rod. Okay, got the rod. And you can sit on it if you want, or you can make the Morello. I should I wait? I can wait until Arc Raptors. No. Yeah, because well, the thing is, is um, the big power spikes for uh now you can do are like Blade Master or like uh, or uh, Demolitionist or Celestial. Celestial is super strong. If you can get that with Lulu at nine. And you should just start slow pushing nine. Slow pushing nine? That means waiting till 50 gold and rolling the extra? Or what does it mean? Yep, just waiting. Just don't do anything till after PP. Should the rebels be in any kind of different order? Put, put everybody back. You want Aesol? So Aesol is stronger the longer the fight is. So just keep that okay. in mind. <coughs> Where should MF and GP be? I usually like like this. That's fine. Maybe back fine or more. ideal. He'll, he'll probably like, think of if he's going to get one shot like that or not. Okay. Should I finish him? Oh, yeah. I'll wait. Yeah, you can wait. <coughs> Level 7, this guy. Whoa. Oh, I got pulled. Okay, so there's a thing I do. I'm guessing it's troll from what you're telling me. I'll move Aethel around to tank Zephyrus and tank Cook, but I just always want him in the center for the damage. Yeah, pretty much. This comp is all about deactivating your brain mm -hmm. and just picking up a soul. Okay. You get the jinx. Is there any... Re is there a re should I not roll for the five stars right now to deny other people from accessing a soul's GP and MF? Because I got to eight first and I can spend my gold and uh, get, the get them two start before other people can even touch them. Yeah, but like... Another big thing is not just the upgrades, it's or the units, it's the upgrades. Like, they're power-ups. Yeah. And those things are expensive as fuck and kind of hard to find on level 8, so... Okay. And then, like, if you get Lulu and then you actually get Sona and you get Mystic too, which is just... Okay. That's super good. So, say I didn't got here and hit all the units that I wanted. Well, I would I just be... be sitting on, like, a level... It'd be the same thing. i just have level 1... Like Aesol on the board. I would never like roll super deep. Okay. Well, say I didn't get lucky and I didn't get like Aesol GPMF all in one go. I would be rolling and finding them, right? Oh, I just have like Kale and something. You just like make make the best of what you got. Uh -huh. yeah, you get that Sona and then now you can sell Ziggs and transfer. Should I commit to Morel? Or I'll commit to Morel after this. Put Sona where Jinx is. Well, I'm like... We committed the giant flare to E. It was not better, and you think it's better to just commit it and then instead of waiting to give it to Jinx, right? Jinx is worthless. Okay, 
She's so fucking worthless. A lot of times she's doing like she's. I guess not in this case, but no, there was times but... where I was playing it... where she was topping charts. If you're playing it properly, the fight yeah. should go like GP ults and it kills her entire team instantly, and then like Aesol cleans up. Okay. Oh, those items. Uh. Got oh, no. Nice. Okay, so do demolitionist, Morello, and Aesol. That's fine. Okay. And you can. Okay, there's shield. Upgrade. Yep. And get the Sona. And just still slow push. You can put Morello in, in Demolition Sona Aesol. Okay. And then all your other items just start going into GP and, and MF. So you can do like... Uh... Yeah, those items suck. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're like Yi or Jinx items, no? Yeah, I guess you can put Giant Slayer on Jinx. It's like whatever. Let's, let's do that. Okay. Those items suck. Maybe you get lucky and get like a thief start later or something. I don't know. There's no way to get thieves anymore. Or at least well, no, you got two car item. two carousels for now. It can be a half item, and thief club is worth more sometimes. Okay. So you can just wait. Okay, this guy is. Oh, you got that dragon claw though. My GP's not ulting. Hmm. That's fine. He's not gonna ult until he's too hard. Cool. Like, and if he ults, he doesn't have upgrades, so the radius is too small. That's why going to nine is super important. Okay. There's Sona. So like important when you play these kind of team comps is understand like uh like before you do your role, like understand like what power spike you're trying to hit, you know? And like mentally mentally like note that. My endgame was a lot shorter than your endgame. My endgame like approached a lot faster where I'm like, oh I hit eight, I this is my end game, I just upgrade my units where you're looking at like level nine, you're looking at Upgrade for GP, two stars on everything. That's how, because if you play like that, how you're yeah. talking about, you're playing for like third or second. Okay. But like the guy who's like really greeting it out and getting like the strongest support possible, that's how you get yeah. first. So if I'm playing like how I did, that's how I should play if I don't have, if I didn't go off in the early game. You would and look, I need to like, you would look like Soju. You would look like Soju. The uh -huh. third place guy. You see how he like but, dropped, he dropped health really low early, right? Yeah. And then he rebounded it once he hit his synergies. Yeah. And that's why, I like, the lost streaks and the win streaks are important. Like, understanding streaks is really important. Okay. So I would just, if I didn't go off early, then I would just be taking damage and hoarding gold and still trying to be greedy. Yep. And okay. playing for, like, Carousel Pro. Just start putting points in the levels. <clears throat> okay. Is MF even going off in the fights? Did she do damage? No. Uh, no, she's fine. She's giving blaster at least. There's what, 10 of the level fives? I think it's nine. I think they lowered it. I'm not sure on that though. Okay, so he has Sarah, so he's probably stronger than you. But we'll see. Whoa. You do have Dragon Whoa. Claw. No. Whoa. It's, a, it's okay. Disappeared. I mean, you have a lot more money than he is. I mean, his board strength is pretty close, but I think it's just the Seraph's difference. I think he also had Mystic in, which is big. Protector? Oh. No. Death Cap or Morello on GP, right? These two? Yeah, you can do Morello GP. It's fine. Just to get the upgrade. What's the more ideal? Death Cap or Morello? They're both fine. Yeah, I didn't get well, either what's, GP. What's better? If you could pick... If I, if I could pick an item right now, if it's Death Cap or Morello. All right, so... If GP ults late game and he hits you, you die instantly, right? So it would be death cap. Yeah. Okay. But Morello's fine because it's health and AP. It's, it's, it's just the, stat, the raw stats are fine. You can start putting levels. I would switch. How close are you to leveling? 24. After I would level, level and put Mystic in. Level right now? Yep. And roll for a mystic, get the jinx, but try to find a mystic. Okay. The larger. There's one. Yeah, you just passed. Whatever. Oh, my bad. You just put another ace on then. And sell the echo. No. It's fine. Just sit until after PV now. Oh, hit the. Oh, fuck, it hits the GP. The GP doesn't matter until he's two starred.
do your thing, do your thing, stun them, stun her. <laughs> <laughs> so usually when I do that roll down, I will never go below 10 gold, but it's fine. Okay. So you know how you're talking about, you can just buy that and then mm -hmm. play it to GPN. Or you can put, actually Blitz is better than GP maybe. Here? Uh, no, I just put another GPN. Okay. So it, the thing is, is like it's really hard to come out of 10 gold. Like if you, if you have less than 10 gold, just because the way interest works, it's yeah. you almost never want to go below 10 gold. It's super hard to come out of. Where should I put the blitz here? If uh, I put the if I played him. Just anywhere to like soak blitz hooks or some shit. So like right oh, here. Asel, move Aesol, move Aesol, move your Aesol. He's not in the middle. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so like I'll do my level nine push like a little earlier than like waiting waiting till after PvE. Just to you know, you're kinda of oh. talking about like people will maybe like roll down and get the units first. I just yeah. do my, I do it as like a level nine all in. I do it like it's a little faster tempo. Okay. So if I waited till after the PV, then maybe I have more gold, but probably less chance of getting the units. You can just put that on Jinx. Dave, your item's kind of, kind of wonk, but it's fine. They're booty. Well, I highly prioritize my, Rebels looked really different than yours. My Rebels was demo mid-game and, like, be strong mid-game and then max out at 8. Yeah, but demo just sucks. It's like, there's just better synergies you can play. Like, Rumble's is, like, not a good unit. He's, like, only good if you give him, like, mech pilot and shit. You can scout what the other people got. You should always be scouting what the top four people have. Okay. Like, you need to start paying a lot more attention. I've been kind of, like, lazy about pushing it, but... You, there should be a lot more scouting involved in this game. Okay. I normally scout a lot. Oh, Mystic. Yeah, you can put that in. Try to um, find Lulu, though. You can roll. You, should be, you shouldn't be waiting. Like, every second oh, you're roll. waiting now is a yeah. second where somebody is hitting something. Okay, put Lulu in instead. You can sell that. Oh. You can sell Aesol, yeah. too. Yeah, sell the... Here. Nice. Sell him right now. Shouldn't I hold him? You can hold him now. You put the hurricane oh. on the jinx. Okay. And then you just put glove on him, Matt. And then just focus on scouting now. Okay. So sell uh, Aesol and hold uh, that Kale, actually. Kale's something you can add, maybe, but probably not. Would yeah. I ever play Kale? Uh, if you get like a uh, spat or some shit like that. Damn, he's got the Seraph on the Aesol. It's kind of rough. Oh my god, it's a fucking carrier fight. Easy clap. Get the other kill? Uh, just sell or it. Or roll for JP. Just, just sell it. And wait. Just don't, just don't do anything yet. Just sell it okay. and wait. And be scouting. You have to prioritize. Like, scouting is like... Okay. Do you use the number keys to scout? Or do you click? Yeah. I, I what okay. there's no point to using number keys right now, and I have to click because yeah, it's yeah. too late in the game. So, Seraph right here, so it would knock up the. I just played him. I'm gonna play this guy. This guy has no Seraph. Yeah, so they, these right people both look really weak. This is a weak lobby actually. <clears throat> oh, I'm ghosted. Oh, he has purple beam. I need to dodge that. Yep. I mean, he's gonna always hit your ace all. You're not even looking at the ghost fight. Well, it doesn't matter what happens in the ghost fight, you know? Yeah, you mean you still take damage, but yeah. I guess you killed one of them, right? I think you just win. Do I level? Or do I roll for my things? One time. GP. Just roll once. Okay. Well, is there a reason why I'm not rolling like right now as fast Cause as possible? Because you're not losing. It's like it, the upgrades I was telling about. Those upgrades are like 8 gold each. Okay, so GP and would... and both of those people have GPs, don't they? Oh, put your locket better, by the way. Your your also. Okay. Put it where the the Y is. Okay. And then put Lulu next to. Make her eat the locket. Yep. Okay. GP. If I fight him with his purple beam. Oh, he doesn't own a purple beam. Okay, so this goes on the GP. Zephyr should go on the GP. Oh, he doesn't have a purple beam. Uh, as long as his MF doesn't. Destroy. I think he just win versus this guy. GP boom. Oh, one of the polymorph hit the soul. He got fucked. 
And then you can scout the other guy. Oh, you just win. Okay. Wait, don't you win? What that, the hell? And that's it's how for you, anticlimactic victory. And that's how you play every game with every comp. You just get right. to level whatever, and then just put legendaries in. And that's pretty much it.